All right, hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video on the Flow of Consciousness YouTube channel. And today it's story time. And I'm very excited about this because I think it's a very interesting and entertaining story that I want to share with you guys. So, yesterday I went to one of my favorite places here in Tulum. It's called Holistica. And it's a very energetic, chill place. It's in the jungle. There's lots of trees and tables and palm trees and it's a very open space there's lots of sunlight there is a very creative energy there and people are very kind and talkative and there's these large tables where everybody sits and works but because it's large tables everybody sits close to one another and you strike up a conversation very easily and there was this one guy who saw that there was some kind of crypto meetup event somewhere in Tulum and he thought it was there. So he, he comes to, to the table and he asks, hey, is this the crypto meetup? And everybody sitting there was like, no, there used to be one earlier somewhere else, whatever, whatever. Um, but right now it's not here. He was like, okay, anyways, I will just sit down and uh, we start talking. And it turns out to be that he was Johan Wolf. So maybe if you guys few of you guys know who he is and um, I thought it was funny that his last name was my first name and uh, we started talking a little bit about different topics and he was like very charismatic person you know uh, older guy blonde hair very skinny face quite muscular good-looking guy and um, he told me about his life experiences and he was a movie director and he did lots of things and at some point we arrive at a very interesting story and this is the story that I want to share with you guys so he started to talk about uh, experience when he was younger that at one point one of his friends they gave him this plastic Ewok figure and probably most of you guys know what an Ewok is if you don't know what an Ewok is is these hairy little animal like creatures from Star Wars the first trilogy I think they live on Ewok I am not sure the planet please don't shoot me if I butcher this I can't remember correctly anyways is these hairy creatures they look like bears, a little bit like bears. And um, he, so one of his friends, he gave him this plastic Ewok figure, right? And he starts talking about the fact that, so this Ewok figure is actually holding a tambourine and he is about to, to hit the tambourine. <laughs> and Joan continues to talk about that one evening one night when he was uh, older and he probably smoked something he was <laughs> looking at this figure and he, he saw the expression on the face of the figure and the Ewok is about to to hit the tambourine and he actually all of a sudden it's 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 it struck him that oh this Ewok is in a perpetual state of ta-da so he is actually always forever in this state of look at me, I'm about to hit the tambourine, ta-da! And, <laughs> and he all of a sudden realized that this is what life is about. This is exactly what life is. It's the universe showing you all the time in every situation, ta-da! Here I am, ta-da! Here I am. It's in a perpetual state of ta-da! Tadaism, that's how he calls it. And so, for example, you have a flat tire with your car. The universe is like, ta-da! And you can then decide what to do with this situation. You can then decide whether you want to see it as, as a blessing or as a nuisance. And we went on talking about the fact that all the obstacles we face in our lives, in retrospect, they turn out to be blessings and I think it's remarkable to think about the fact that whenever we 
find ourselves in a difficult state, in a difficult situation, or when we face an obstacle, we tend to forget that down the road, this will probably become a very significant experience in our lives that shapes us into a better human being, right? So he went on talking about whenever you face an obstacle, whenever you face a difficult situation, try to time travel six months into the future and look back to this current state and understand that it's none other than the universe telling you, ta-da, here is an experience for you to learn something from. And I thought that that was such an, a fantastic way of approaching life. It's a, it's, a, it's a fantastic mindset to have that whenever you face something challenging, see the humor in it. Understand that it's none other than the universe just showing you, here I am, like the Ewok, Pookie, the name is Pookie, the Ewok, ta-da, I'm about to make some music, ta-da, here, here I am, here is your challenge, here is your lesson, here is your whatever uh, experience to teach you something. And uh, I think it's absolutely incredible and very beautiful way to, to look at life. So I wanted to share this with you in a shorter video because some of you give me the feedback that my videos are quite long. So I wanted to keep it short and concise. Story time. I love it. And um, I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. See you later.